I've just always been interested in religion and I've always painted it. I just fell into it by chance. I went to Seville because of a horoscope. It was Samana Santa. I had absolutely no money, so I just took to the streets and started drawing. Because it was in Samana Santa, there was a load of things to draw. Everyone's probably heard of the Macarena, the, the famous summer hit of last year. The Macarena is a statue of the Virgin Mary, one of the most famous in all of Spain and apparently the most beautiful. I used to sleep rough outside. Uh, a local one used to give me sandwiches every day. To the outsider it looks quite pagan as people stay up all night in processions, getting drunk, eating, so there's all sorts of ulterior motives. For, for doing Samana Santa. A lot of people in the hoods, they're called Nazarenes, which means lepers. And they, they're in hoods because they have sins. And this is their penance. This particular day, I was fed up with the crowd, so I just headed to a quiet park and started sketching. Today I met Domingo for the first time. Two motorbikes ran over all my paintings that I'd done, all the sketches I'd done that day and destroyed them. So I was fairly low when I met him first. Hello, my name is Domingo. Are you interested in doing some paintings for me? And I said, yeah. I helped an angel and then God comes to, to help me. He did it on the basis of this one drawing, just a man and a woman dancing, and he, uh, he just did it all on the basis of that, that one drawing.
he was he was a priest who you know plain clothes who uh, had a had a church up in in a town called Bilches in Chayen about three hours away and there was no stations of the cross it had been destroyed in the civil war so the chances that the last thing I painted was the stations of the cross and then two years on on the street in another country a man would come up and ask me to paint the self same thing it's just absurd so it, it changed my life from that point on <laughs>